In this video, we're going to travel down to Capitola and spread some of Uncle Jim's ashes. Kind of a final goodbye. So we flew down to San Francisco, rented a Tesla, drove over to Capitola. Got an Airbnb. Here we are, our little home away from home. Man, this is great. All right, we got into the Airbnb that's hot. We went over and had a nice dinner with Scott and Sherry at Zelda's on the water with a nice sunset. I guess the blood pumping. Just walking up the stairs, I'm gonna go by the old house. And then the next day, Ginger got into town with Sarah and Lana and Kita. They stayed at the Monarch Cove Inn over there. We had a nice walking around, checking out Grandma's house. There's Ginger, Lana, Kita. Beautiful property. Sarah arrived. <laughs> uh, we spread some Uncle Jim's ashes in front of the bench by Grandma's house, and some other people spread other ashes somewhere else in town. Put up into two groups Matt, Sarah, Lana, Dasha, Annabelle. <laughs> We're going the Mexican food route. And then you have everyone else going to Gail's Bakery. <laughs> oh, bakery. I think they're so special. This is, oh, we got our blue plate special. Well, does it come with salsa? <laughs> takeout dinner. The blue box looks good. Ones that have my one of my friends did this heart with the J on it. Mm -hmm. And this one actually has his ashes and poppy seeds. So if you want to throw them somewhere like in your yard or somewhere with the poppy seeds you cut them up. Sunday was the big day. Uncle Scott rented two sailboats and we were going to dump most of Jim's ashes out near the pier in Capitola. We could have just walked out on the pier, but a big storm destroyed portions of the pier and it's not operational. The pier is closed because of some major damage. The waves ripping up the pier deck, you see it right there, and part of the structure has collapsed. Group is breaking up. All right. Yeah. 
All right. Yeah, see what we're going on. The wind got us. <laughs> we'll, we'll wake you up in the Capitola. <laughs> My dad's taking us out there. Oh, does it feel? Hello sailors. Ahoy. 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 Capitola. I mean, his ashes uh, kind of represent that for us right now, but you know what I was thinking about the most on this trip? You know, we come out here, we're seeing this beautiful Capitola from this point of view is kind of cool. I mean, Jim's gone from us right now. I mean, he's alive in our stories and memories, and I think we're all very happy that we had the chance and I can tell you Scott and Ginger, Johnny on the spots when he got sick really made a difference for giving him some time. Lana, you know, she was there helping. And one thing that did for me was it gave me a week with Jim. I had a really great week with Jim. And I think we all thought, you know, he's, he's reacting to the medicines well. He's, uh, you know, looks like a you know a few years for all of us. Then he was gone. But for our captains here, I want to tell you a story about Jim. And uh, it's it makes this story interesting because one of the favorite things in this end time, and I think we all know, man, life moves pretty quick, especially for. For us older ones, I mean, you turn around and what the heck, I'm an old man now. Almost anyway, but so Jim, on the day he died, he left a note. He left a note for Matt. You know, Matt and him were closer than Jim and I at that time. And, and uh, but him and they both did cryptocurrencies and Jim had a little bit of cryptocurrency in a bank and he wanted to leave that to Matt. And so in this note, what he said was, if you're reading this, my condolences. And here's the numbers to my account and enjoy. And so I think what all of that made us feel really good was, and I, I really take my hat off to Jim and, or Scott and Ginger and, and Lana for helping. And, and even myself going down there. I mean, I had more of an easier trip, but we know that Jim had a sense of humor on the day he died and that he what must have been at some piece to be able to do that. So that's kind of my favorite story of Jim, really. But we have some others, I think. I think at this time, if you want to just put the ashes in, Scott, and everybody's got some kind of Jim story, and we're going to just 
enjoy this time that Scott put this little trip together. We just enjoy this time. Jim, we're gonna miss you forever and ever. We're gonna leave you here in a place that we know you love. And And uh, Jim will have us laughing till the end of our own days, just remembering him and and uh, keeping his uh, jokes in our heart and seeing him pretend to be Jack Nicholson and um, care of us. You know, Jim just took care of us all in so many ways. He loved he loved us all deeply. Full circle. I guess head back. Coming in the harbor. The weather in Capitola was beautiful, it was warm for early October, the sailing was great, and it, overall it was just an amazing way to say goodbye to Uncle Jim.